Hey guys, how's it going? So I wanted to share this really quick tip for you guys for your Shopify store. Sometimes you go to online stores and when you hover over a product, it'll show you another image. And in Shopify, unless your theme supports it, normally what you'd have to do is download and pay for an app. I haven't found any free apps that will show you like the second or third or last image uh, when you hover over it. To let you know what I'm talking about here, this is uh, Mr. Beast. If you don't know, he's a great YouTuber. Um, but this is his shop. And as you can see, when I mouse over these products, his t-shirts, it shows me another image. So that's what I'm gonna show you how to do today, just with code, simple code. I'm gonna provide it to you. It's gonna be really fast. So uh, this is my Shopify store here. And as you can see right now, when I hover over these images, nothing happens. Uh, so I'm gonna change that. We're just gonna go back. And uh, if you're using your main thing, just go ahead and go to edit code. I made a new theme here, but go ahead and go to actions and edit code. You could do it on your main one if that's your store. And all you're going to do is look for a couple things in here and replace a code. So I provided this. Um, it's in the link in the description. But you're going to take this code here. There's two pieces of code. Just copy it. And this says go to assets and themes.css. That's what I put on there for you to find it easy. So under assets, you'll see themes.css. And then this one at the very bottom, all you do is come down here and paste the code and hit save. And then you'll get the other code that I provided. Copy that. And as you can see, this one goes snip bits, product cart grid liquid, or something similar to that. Sometimes different themes have it named differently, but this is gonna be product card, it was grid? Yes, grid liquid. Then you're gonna open this one. And this one, you're actually just gonna delete this and do that. That should be it. So now they're both saved. Now, if I go back to the store that I just checked the code, uh, let's go ahead. You can view your store however you want. but And if I go to like a collection page, here's the same, same page we were on. There we go. It's showing me the second image uh, after the first one. So... That's it. You don't have to pay for any fancy apps. You don't have to, you know, shell out extra cash for the add-ons or anything like that. That was just a very simple way of doing it. And if you guys want some one-on-one -on -one help with your Shopify store, I am doing one-on-one -on -one coaching at the moment. I'll go ahead and link my email and my Instagram, uh, and you can message me on one of those two things if you're looking for that. So thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.